Hi, this is Marloom's Creations, and today I will be showing you how to create this mini carrot charm to attach to your Easter bunnies. The first thing you will need is your rainbow loom set up straight. It should not be staggered, and the arrow should be facing you. Then you will need orange bands and green bands. The first step is you take two orange bands. and place it from here to here. Two more from here to here. Double from here to there. Next we will be taking double and placing it from there to there. And then on this peg, you place this down. And on the last, it's also double. Then you will grab a single orange band and wrap it around the last peg only three times. Now we will create the top of the carrot. You want to grab your crochet hook and put three green bands on your hook, then grab another and thread the three bands onto that one loop. Then you are going to make a knot, a slip knot with this one. Pull it through and now you have those three bands secured to this one band. You can put that down. Do that again. You're going to do this three times. Put three bands onto your hook and grab another band, slide all those three on there, and then place your hook through the other loop, pull that over and make a slip knot. Slide these on, place your hook through both loops, and make a slip knot. Now you will grab one of these and you will place it on here. The long loop is the one we're working with, the single one. And you will wrap it around three times only, once, two, three, like that. You will do the same with this one. Grab the single loop, wrap it on here, only three times. Now if you want your um, top of your carrot to be bushier, you can. This is how it looks with just the three. I thought that was pretty thick. And you can grab the last one. You can place it on either peg, it doesn't matter. And wrap it around three times as well. And now we will place the capping bands, the horizontal capping bands. You will take an orange band and place it from, actually I'm sorry, you will take a green band and place it from here to here and wrap it around twice. And then you will take an orange band and place it from here to here and also wrap it around twice. And the same with this one from here to here and wrap it around twice. Now we can loop. You're going to place your hook and enter that capping band and just reach underneath and grab the bottom two bands and loop it forward. Then you're going to grab the next, the top two bands, and 
make sure you're only grabbing the top two. If it's hard, you can pull to the side and then reach in. And you're going to place that forward. Then reach in for the last two and pull that forward. Pull this horizontal band back and pull that bottom two to the peg above. Seam this. Pull these behind. Grab the bottom two and pull that forward. Push this band away. Grab the bottom two. Pull that forward. Same with these. And then once you get to this part, you're going to grab another green band and first place your hook through this one and grab a green band and place it onto your crochet hook and slide it to the top. And then you're going to make a slip knot with this. And then just pull. And this can become part of the uh, top of the carrot. Same thing with this one. Place your hook into here. Grab another green band. Make sure you pull it through all these. Then make a slip knot. Place this band over here and pull. And you can take your um, carrot off of the loom slowly. This is what your carrot should look like, your little carrot charm. Now you're going to grab your scissors. I forgot to tell you guys to have a scissor. And you're going to put your scissor through some of these loops and pull and then cut. Pull and cut. And then you are going to grab another green band. And tie it around here two times. It's just to pinch it together. And if you want these a little bit smaller, you can trim them. So that they're even. It's really up to you. And then, once you make the bunny, you can just grab this band in the back and grab that band and you can just place it over his arm. And then it looks like he's holding a carrot. Let's get all this off. And this is your very quick tutorial on how to make a mini carrot charm for the Easter Bunny. Thank you and if you like my videos please subscribe.